Hey guys, uh, today I want to show a program that I made uh, for Smash Tournament or just Smash Matches on YouTube. This is a thumbnail generator. Uh, all you need to do is open it up. It'll come in a folder or it'll come in a zip with the executable and a portraits folder that has all the portraits of all the characters. Um, basically, when you first open it, it has this list, and it's just basically a dump of all the different names of the different files in the portraits folder. Um, all these portraits were ripped by, what's his name, uh, Random Talking Bush from the Strider, Spriders resource. And if at any time you put a new um, image in here, or you delete one, while this is running, you can click refresh list and it'll uh, reset the list and redump all the file names. Uh, this right here, oh. excuse, excuse the man on the motorcycle. Um, this first input is the first player's name, so I have all these compressed videos that I'm going to be uploading. Uh, so let's pick, um, 2x Dare versus Wig Beats. So I'm just going to open this. Uh, so as we can see, it was, uh, Robin, the Red Robin, and the, um, uh, original style Toon Link, so we're going to say uh, 2x Dare, where I'll put the name right there, versus Big Beats, puts the name there. Uh, this is going to be, you can either look for it in here, uh, where some of the names are Japanese names and some of them are kind of weird, where like uh, Gekuja, Gekouja, uh is actually uh, Greninja. We have uh, Koopa Jr. and Koopa are Bowser and Bowser Jr. Uh, Lizardon is um, Charizard. Um, Morabito is uh, Villager. Uh, so we're looking for, uh, and then Pit B is Dark Pit for uh, Pit Black. Uh, Refl uh, Reflet is the name for uh, Robin, so Red Robin is uh, Reflet underscore seven, um, and then uh, I'm going to take this and put this down here, and as you can see, the portraits don't go away when they're erased. Let me close the door really quickly. There are just too many buses and trucks going by. Um, so the portraits don't go away when you just erase it. You have to type in none, which will pick up on a blank image that I made and put into the portraits folder. Uh, and I also know that in the second round, Dare uses the original Robin. So I'm going to go like that. And Wigbeats uses uh, character chr underscore 11 underscore tune link underscore zero eight the whole time so i'll just be like that um and then now that i'm done i can click export go back to the folder it'll export this file um youtube doesn't like the exports that this does i'm working on uh fixing that so that it'll export it in a way that youtube likes the thumbnails um, but for right now, you just have to go to a website like uh, con Image Online Convert. Uh, I'll have this in the description, and you just even though it comes out in a JPEG, you will have to like go back and convert it to JPEG again. So it starts in JPEG, convert it, convert the file, um, and then once it's exported you convert it and once it's converted this converted file will be able to work with youtube's systems for some reason if you just upload 
this file, it'll come out as black. And the program will always save um, its exports as first player versus second player dot jpg. It's not it's identical file, but um, YouTube will like these. Um, and then when you're done, you can go ahead and close it. Um, I think that's everything. Oh, right. Uh, it saves it as the first name versus second name dot jpg. Uh, and if you already have a file that's named this and you save one, say like they rematched, make sure that you've either moved this file to another folder or you've renamed it. Um, otherwise it will overwrite the first, uh, file. It'll overwrite this one, um, because it has the same name. Other than that, this comes out looking pretty good. Uh, there's a little bit of JPG going on in the middle bit, uh, and around the character portraits, but, uh, it came out looking pretty good. So I'm going to be working on this a little bit more where I'm going to make it so you can change this image, change the background, change the nameplates, um, maybe add an image in the middle or at the bottom for a tournament's logo. But for right now, this is how it is. You can find a link to the download, uh, down below. And I hope that you can get some use out of this. Thanks.